welcome J.C. Watts, a congressman from Oklahoma. Thank you for taking your time to speak with us. Thank you for having me. It would be fair to say that every American has a budget that they have to live inside, as well as the federal government. And when an American cuts money from their budget, they have a dollar amount that they cut. So wouldn't it be fair to assume that the candidates should also have dollar amounts that they're willing to cut from the federal budget? Well, that's why you have budgets, and that's why you have balanced budgets. That's why Congress, when Newt Gingrich was Speaker, we passed a balanced budget amendment in the House. We couldn't pass it in the Senate. Uh, th that's why we've said all along that we've not seen a budget from this president. We've not, not, not just a balanced budget, we've not seen a written budget from, 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 this, president, uh, from this president. That never happened with Newt Gingrich was Speaker, that we didn't present a budget and you have budget numbers in those budgets. That's why we had a balanced budget for four years when, when he was Speaker. Two, when his, his last two years as Speaker, but the other two, he had laid the framework for us to do it two, pre, uh, two more years after he, had, after he had left. So no, you do have to have budgets. That's what, I have budgets. I know how much I can spend for car payment. I know how much I can spend for entertainment. I know how much it's going to cost me in terms of, you know, my kids' tuition and, 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 and trying to buy kids school clothes. All Americans do that. But, you know, Newt, that's one of the reasons I'm supporting Newt Gingrich. We hadn't had a balanced budget but one time in my lifetime of 54 years. It was when Newt Gingrich was, was the speaker. So, you know, I, I, I agree with you. <laughs>